All right, we just tried to watch our first ever movie in the Tesla here. I have MCU 2, which is an upgrade from the original MCU 1. And it has the infotainment system, but I, apparently the first time I tried to watch Amazon Prime videos, it doesn't work. As you can see, it says there's it's an unsupported browser. We're going to see if we can figure out a workaround. All right, I've heard that this might work. Going to this URL may allow for a workaround so let's try it let's see what happens when I tap the enter symbol Denise is gonna have a hiccup that's what's gonna happen ah so it gives me prime video. a bunch of options where's prime video right here do we tap on prime video is that what we do I guess did so. you tap on it yeah, I it. Take the cookies. wait hold on except wait, except wait, cookies We've already signed into Amazon Prime, by the way, which was a process in itself because they don't want anybody else using your account or hacking into it for that matter. Oh, now what? In. Now we just go to the movie. What are we going to watch? The Knife or something like yeah, that? Yeah, it looks like we got to sign in again with that. Uh, hello, sign in. Yeah, I do have to sign in again. All over again. I asked to remember, but it does remember if I sign in. All right, I've got to go through the same authentication process all over again. I guess it did install something on here, and i got to go through it again. All right, so we just refreshed it, and it, it recognizes me, so let's put in the movie. Do we know what movie it was? And I see the differences. Look, I'm on Amazon.co.uk, and it says Delivered to the United States. So I'm on a different Amazon version of their, of their site. I guess I'm not in the United States now, right? Mm -hmm. So if I won't let it happen in the United States, I'm guessing. Yes, I will. Right. Stuff. It won't let me watch the movies in the Tesla in the United States. So I have to log into another country's Amazon browser, I guess that's what we're doing. I've gone through your junk pile again. All right, that's it. Knives out. Yeah. So let's see if it lets us do this. And then I wonder if it's going to let us expand the screen, too. Let's see. Oh, I have to pay? What? Mm. Wait a minute. Introducing Prime Video, Prime Video... Well, I thought so. I I guess I don't have Prime Video in the UK. Well, this is the 4K version. Maybe we can go back and go to the cheap version. No. There were multiple copies of this video. See, this one is different. Okay. Yeah. Try that one. Did you tap it. Yes, I did. Rent. Hmm. Watch with stars. Stars. All right. Hmm. I'm not sure if this is going to work. All right. This still isn't working yet. Denise just brought up the fact that Elon Musk and Jeff Bezos are in a battle. <laughs> so, and I have an Elon Musk versus Jeff Bezos uh, group on Facebook. If you want to join that, there's over 5,000 members. Let me try to change the country. Maybe that fixes it, or maybe it completely destroys everything that I'm trying to do. Amazon UK. It says United Kingdom. Oops. So I don't think it's going to work for Amazon. This may work for other things, but not for Amazon. If you know of a way to do it, please let me know in the comments. I'm going to go back to United States, and my guess is it'll say browser unsupported. And then when you're in the UK, it basically doesn't recognize my Prime subscription service. I guess it's only good in one country or something. Uh... What was it called again that we were on? Knives Out. Okay, let's put put that back. All right, so let's go to recently viewed. It's taking this good old time, and it says watch now, but we're back in the United States site. I'm guessing it's going to tell me browser is not supported. We can do a watch party. Create a watch party. Not. Maybe that's the only way to get it to work. I think. There it is, unsupported browser. So it's not going to work. If anybody has any ideas, please let me know in the comments. I guess you need 